Welcome guys, it is the Axeman here, and we are back on Ark Survival Evolved with some more plays of Dino, yeah boy, and today we've got a big spicy line to do, as you can probably tell by the video title or thumbnail, but I'm going to explain what we're doing and why we're doing that. So first off, we're going to start with the Dilophosaurus. So actually, you know what, I should probably start with the end game because then, you know, the first ones make sense. We're actually going to finish up with the new, the brand new Evo slash Paleo Giganotosaurus. Now, this is obviously the new guy. He's absolutely amazing. He's chunky. I love him. That's our end game. Now, we need to find a creature that evolves into him. And when I posted a video on Calibus about him, a lot of people said it looked like a big aloe version or an aloe and a rex mixed together. I liked that. So, aloe is going to be the middle stage. And I, I can see the Giga in that, especially the brand new design. That works really well. But now... We need to find some that goes into the aloe. And this is the one I always struggle with. There's only a few small mid-sized creatures that work well with these carnos. Oh, these carnivores, sorry. Normally, I'd go for a raptor. A raptor's a great small slash mid-sized carnivore. I could see that going into an aloe. But this time, we're going to go for the Paleodilophosaurus. Now, hear me out. It's bigger and better than the regular Dilophosaurus, which I do love and it's not a raptor <laughs> that's my only explanation for this it's not a raptor but it's on you know it's on two feet it's got the arms it, it's dangerous it wants to eat stuff so what happens is when we evolve i guess the crest and all that stuff becomes the weird spiky thing on the aloe and we, we like to form packs and yeah i don't know man i just thought it kind of works and also the chibi version of this guy is the most amazing thing i've ever seen in my life look at this guy oh i kind of really 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 want to do the chibi version of him because he is just a chunk oh my god i love him so much i want like a plushie of just this man that's so adorable uh no we'll go for the we'll go for the normal one for now anyways so we need to pick a, a color scheme now it's gonna be very hard to do this because you're very spotty and every bright color one if we're not careful makes you kind of look like a clown like that is kind of cool but also the worst color thing i've ever seen in my whole life um is there anything that's taken my fancy we may have to go manual for this because these are all looking really weird man what about black and red i think we've done a black and yellow recently but a black and red might be kind of fire okay let's go dilu and we're gonna spawn uh we kind of want some babies uh where would the dilophosaurus spawn they normally spawn in the swamps don't they what's the easiest way to get to the swamp on the calibus map uh it doesn't seem like there is one is there not one at all because i'm gonna have to travel through mountains there you know what maybe the middle maybe is the middle is what we need all oh, right we are hopping into the world as a dilophosaurus we're a male which means we've now got to go and find as a female to start and obviously survive okay let's see what's going on here so yeah we are a beautiful dilophosaurus let's just have a look at us yeah you know what maybe i could have gone for a bit of a darker red underneath but that's kind of fire flame do we do a little emote we do do a little emote i like that okay well let's head down to the swamp is that this way yeah let's head down to the swamp let's see if we can find us a beautiful little female and then we can start a family and then evolve into an allosaurus but before we do that if you enjoy these episodes if you enjoy plays of dino make sure you are whacking the like make sure you're subscribing you ring the bell you're enabling notifications following the social medias you know the the drill by now and also if you do have a line that you think would work really well then also whack that in the comment section Obviously, it has to make sense. You know, it can't be a dodo into a giga. Then that giga goes into a wyvern. Just doesn't work, really, does it? I mean, I guess maybe it does a little tiny bit. <laughs> maybe that was a bad example. But yeah, you, you know what I'm saying. All right. Um, hmm. I would have loved to kill that galley. Do I want to fight Iguanodon? I do. Could be a bad idea. Because now his friends might join in. Are we good? Can I spit at you? Spit. There you go. Add some spit on your face. Oh, God. Gally, get out of here. Um, right. I thought I'd be able to take an Iguanodon on. Uh, we are very low health. We are very... Oh, God. Here comes his friend. Oh, God. I can't even run away. Stop thumbing my butt. Get... Oh, cool. 
Fum Spike, up the butt. Um, would not recommend. Okay, that's cool. We was just kind of learning where we fitted in the food chain. Um, kind of at the bottom. Oh, God. Oh, we've got wolves. Um, don't mind me. Just passing through. Are we like... Okay, I think we're civil. I think me and the wolves, we're, we're civil boys. Um, all right, where are we this time? Hmm, not really much to eat around here. There is an aloe over there, which is cool. We can come back up here to breed. Lots of horses. Won't be able to chase them. Yeah, get it. Oh, God. He just ran right over me. Um, okay, I feel like we're going to need a little bit of stamina here. Uh, we do have a Santa's hat, which I'm not going to put on. I'm not feeling very Christmassy. I'm not, I've not got the Christmas mood right now. I don't know about you lot. Uh, all right. Is it a swamp down here? Yes, it is. Um, can I jump down here? Hmm. What's first person view like? Amazing. It's just like the other Dilophosaurus. What is that? Okay. Um, yeah, so this is where my Dilophosaurus' eyes are. Look at all the trees. Ew, what are them wiggly things? What are they? What are they? Interesting. We've got wiggly things under the... Under the map. Okay. Uh, right, looks like we're going to have to go up and around here. So yeah, all we're doing for the Lothosaurus in order to evolve is just survive and find us a female breed, make a baby, and that's how we're going to get into a gorgeous Allosaurus. I could jump this one, right? Uh, maybe. Go on, slide on here. Yeah, see? Fine. I have legs of steel. Anything that's not a speedy galley, a speedy horse, or an iguanodon would be great. It's just like this is the little speed zone around here. Uh, that's a raptor. Probably not going to be able to fight a raptor. I need lystros. I need dodos. Compies, perhaps? I don't think this was a very good place to start with the Lothosaurus. But if we started anywhere else, we'd have to be climbing up and around a mountain. Well, at least it's a little more swampy now. Um, I can go up and around here, right? So we are looking for a beautiful, gorgeous, really high-level female. Kind of really want to jump down there. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, okay. That works. That's not going to kill us. This isn't going to kill us either. Nice. We're a little bit hurt, but that's okay. All right. Ev oh, yeah, I forgot. Can't do first person. <laughs> All right, everyone keep your eyes and ears open. For a female. Maybe we do like a sniff. Sniff. Sniff the scent of a female around here. That's how we sniff. God, that could be really annoying. Imagine you have your TV really loud. Yep, that's annoying, isn't it? <laughs> uh, oh, oh, oh. I see some. I see a couple. They're like chasing a raptor. Is that a cinema crops? Wait, what? Cinema crops chill around the swamp on this map? Why am I huge? Wait, hang on a second. <laughs> why am I an absolute? Why am I an absolute beast compared to the other ones? Um, I didn't even notice that. That's what size we should be. Can I breed with any of you? Why am I an absolute unit? Uh, yeah. Okay, we've we've made a mistake somewhere. Oh god. Apparently, there is different Dilophosauruses. We're... At, like, that's a female. Okay. I guess that makes more sense to go into the aloe because we're massive. But I didn't realize that we were, like, four times the size of a regular Dilophosaurus. I don't even know what this creature is then. What are we? Um, We only have 500 health. Do we reckon I could fight one of these? Uh, maybe this one over here. I mean, all three of them just absolutely kicked the ass of whatever it was, a raptor. What level are you? Um, game? Can I just see what level this is? Because I can't first person it, so it doesn't have a level, apparently. Uh, it's a level 90. All right. I mean, we knock it back. That works. Oh, yeah. Kick, kick the shit out of it, boys. I am the alpha variant, apparently. I mean, there is an alpha of sources, but maybe there is. That we just didn't know about. Oh, God. These dudes pack a bit of a punch. Hey. That is our first kill. Nice. You know what? Maybe this is what we do to evolve. We just got to kill smaller Dilophosauruses. 
Yeah. This is how we do this series, by the way. We just wing it. We change the rules all the time. God, look at us. I, I just... I can't believe I didn't notice how massive we were. I should, like... I don't know. I should have known, really, shouldn't I? If I go stand next to this parasaur... If yeah, we get there before he be eaten. Yeah, we're like the size of a parasaur. We are. We are the size of a parasaur. Okay, that's ridiculous. Can I take two of these guys on? Yeah, yeah. Mr. Yellow One, you keep running. Okay, I'll stop. Um, all right, so a level nine set. Did pack a bit of a punch. You are at level 20. Easy pickings. You, my friend, are a level unknown. You're a 140. Okay. That's going to be a bit more difficult but if we do the 20 here then the 140 is on his own and he's coming now okay gotta come quick okay got him nice okay you're gonna come fight me as long as we knock you back we'll be all right just keep taking a step back every time we bite oh yeah that's how it's done boys oh god no keep the camera facing this way i wanted to, to show off the sheer size just the sheer mass that we have God damn. I think this is like legit how big a normal Dilophosaurus would have been. Aren't Dilophosauruses the size of humans? Like, you know, real Dilophosauruses? Are we the size of a human? Maybe you're a little bit too big? Um, Alright, we're going to do a bit of health. A bit more health. And a bit more of that melee. I'm going to go and kill this snake. I feel like we've got it in our jellies. We could do this. Come on, I am an alpha. That does 40 damage, of course it does. Um, he is bloody though. Come on, point love source. We got this. We got this. You got this, boy. And look at that. Easy pickings, Mr. Bug. Get out of here. Can I eat you? Because you'll give me a decent level, maybe. Can you get in my mouth, Mr. Bug? Instead of flying around in a little circle. Nearly dead. Am I going to die to a freaking dragonfly? I can't hit him. There we go. All right. I can't believe we saw a cinema crops earlier. That's crazy because I've been in the swamp on Calibus and I've yet to see a cinema crops. I didn't even know they spawned on this map. That's amazing. Well, that's some info we can take back to uh, our other series. That's good. Okay. We have a little hat. We have a little cowboy hat on the back of our head. Okay. That's very weirdly placed. What about the center hat? Um. Yeah, also... Chilling at the back there. Interesting stuff. Okay, right. Uh, we're going to sleep. So that's going to heal us up. So it looks like we're not going to be able to find a partner to breed with because we're, we're just too massy. We have so much mass that we're just not going to be able to find a female. We'll, we'll crush them. You know when we do the making the babe phase? We'll crush them. We're too big. So what I think we'll do is we'll fight one more thing. Use that DNA to turn us into an aloe. How about that? God damn. <laughs> We are a giant freaking Dilophosaurus. I love that. I see a Dilophosaurus in this bush, perhaps. Are you in there, sir? All right, this is our last victim here. Yeah. Let's go. So we're now doing what? Three damage more than we were doing at the start. Amazing. All right. There we go. Get shit on, Mr. Dilophosaurus. Okay, I think it's time for us to transform into a giant aloe. You ready for this? This is going to be absolutely a, an amazing transition just here. And we are now the aloe. Now, obviously, we've got the, the black and red on us as well. Looks kind of fancy, honestly. I don't mind it at all. So, oh. hey, Mr. Razor Tooth. Guess we're fine. Okay, hang on. I will fight you in a second. Let me just get some stamina. Let me just lie down here. Hopefully, you don't aggro to me. Nice. Good stuff. All right. Coming for you, maybe. Come on, let's move. Let's move, Mr. Sir. All right, let's go. 90 damage we do. I like it. Uh, you're not going to scare me. I'm not afraid of anything. Except for, like, rats and spiders. But you're not either of them, so we're fine. I can definitely take you on. That was level 95. Good shit. Okay, well, what we're going to do with the aloe, we're either going to just kill a bunch of shit. Uh, what is that? Ceratosaurus over there. Kill a bunch of shit, get all that... Um, Big, strong, crazy DNA we would need to turn into... Uh, that must be a creature I have over there. I use for a thumbnail because there's damage numbers. Amazing. Let's <laughs> leave him alone. Um, yeah, we'll get all the DNA to turn into a giga. Or if we find an aloe, we'll definitely do like some breeding and get a little babby. Uh, the only issue is we have to find 
uh, a female. We have terrible stamp. All right, leveling what? We have 24 levels. Okay. There we go. That should be enough um, enough stamina now, right? Let's so just going to put a hat on us. What's that look like? Amazing. Look at us. Oh, there's no way we're not attracting a female right now. Um, all right. What I'm going to do, I'm going to stay up here in the mountain areas because aloes like to knock about around here. Hopefully, we, we are a normal aloe this time. We're not like a giant aloe. We're not a tiny aloe. We're just a regular normal dude. This is who we're looking for, boys. Hey, wolf. Wolf, stop it. Wolf. Aloe, fight back. Great. great. We've aggroed him. Um, were you a male anyway? I'm guessing so, because you're not breeding with me. God damn it. Well, we found the aloe. Turns out he has a penis. So, unfortunately, you know, sword fighting isn't going to make us a baby here. Um, do you have any, like, sisters around here, sir, that we could talk to? Can you die? God damn it. That was a 140, sir. Okay. Well, we know we can take on a big 140, dude. Um, all right, eight levels. I feel like we have to go for melee just there. Uh, okay. So, we found one aloe so far, which is weird that it wasn't in a pack, but it is what it is. There's got to be a female aloe somewhere. Well, I found some barrels. I found a vase or a vase. I found... Uh, looks like a dude riding a dragon. Treasure is what I found. Found some treasures. Also found an aloe. How are you, sir? Or madam? Oh, I found two aloes. Oh, um, hello. There's also a Giga. Are we cool with Gigas? Is that a pig going to fight a Giga? Um, yes, maybe. Okay. What we need to do, I need to take my new wife and we need to get out of here. Okay. We have baby. We have wife. We have egg. Are you going to follow me? Follow me. Let's, um, let's get out of here. Just mean I can add in my bead attack, which is kind of cool. Uh, okay. So there is a Giga up there. Oh, it's a Rex. I want to fight a Rex. Uh, can we make a nest? I need keratin. Uh, probably going to fight some Kentros or something. All right, Mr. Rex. I'm going to bleed the shit out of you. Yeah. There we go. What? Oh, my God. Look at that. Oh, Jesus. That's way more damage than we was doing on our own. Oh, I like it. Bleeding out, we're biting, we're taking chunks out of him. Get absolutely shit on Rex. Absolutely shit on. All right. Uh, eight levels. Boom. So there's our egg. So this is some kind of keratin. I'm trying to look around here that what might give me that. It's definitely like Kentros, Stegos. Uh, is that a bright blue? There is a lot of, like, scary big feet behind them trees. One's definitely an R Giga or an X Giga or a Y Giga. Um, there's a bright red summit. And then there's also a purple Giga behind that. Yeah, this is definitely the area to find Gigas, man. 100%. All right, you know what, Mr. Wifey? I'm going to go for a quick nap. Look after me. Guard me. What we've got to do now to go into a Giga is literally put this egg down. Put this nest down, put this egg down. That's all we've got to do. I feel like I've killed enough shit. That's where I could evolve. Uh, pack yourself the sources from Kyan. Is that something you guys do? No. What about you guys? Put that bleed on. Oh, yeah, you do. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, just need a little bit more from you. And wifey, did you grab some of that? Can I access your inventory, please? Uh, you did not get any. Am I? I think I'm one short. I am one shot. Of course I am. Why would I not be? Uh, Alright, come on. One more creature that has keratin somewhere. That's all we need. Aha! There he is. Hello, sir. You are near dead already. Look at that. Hey! Now make a nest. Perfect. Um, Wifey, you're in the way. Can you go, like, I don't know, fight him or... Go and eat him or something. I'll come help. Little monkey man. Okay. Good shit. Okay, nest. 
boom, attach to here, drop down there. So that's a big nest. And then we plop the egg in. And it's doing its business. Um, okay, so I upped the rates by accident. It's now going to take 19 hours and 44 minutes. But with the magic of editing, it would have hatched and we'll be turning into a giga right now. Also a raptor just falling from the sky. I love that. And there we go, boys. Look at that. That thing's cry. I just love how stocky and chunky he is, man. It's so pretty. All right. Let's go and do some damage here. Nom. 201 we're doing. We're only level 50 or whatever we are. Uh, that dude's throwing snowballs or poop balls at us. We're not going to die there, right? Boom. Eat you. Eat you. 342. 351. 359. And you're dead. Amazing. And his friend didn't want to get involved. We got 15 levels from that. Well, you know where all them 15 levels are going to go. All into melee. We're going to put some bunny ears on as well. Um, are they on sideways? Right, I'm no expert, Mr. Giga, but I think you've put them on weird. <laughs> um, okay, this is the brain capacity of this Giga. He's not the smartest. He puts hats on weird. Uh, what about if we put a hunter's hat on? Oh, no, you're fine with that one. Okay. It's just bunny ears. What about Santa hat? Good with that as well? Yeah. Uh, okay, cool. He just doesn't know what to do with the bunny ears. Ah, oh, bless you. Bless your little con socks. Uh, okay. So do we... I don't... Do we have a rage meter still? I don't see a rage meter anywhere. Also, is that an aloe in the water? What is going on down here? Are you... Are you a rex? I think there's... Yeah. There's there's a water rex down there. Aha. But there is also a normal rex here. Or a paleo rex, in fact. Also, I just realized we are very close to where the other gigas are. Amazing. 390 damage we're doing now. Uh, we are out of Stam. Just killed a Dodic. I didn't mean to kill you, sir. He was just in the line of conflict. And 450, 457, 464 damage. I have to say, the black and red on this guy... Fire Flame. Look at them eyes. Not a four behind them eyes, is there? What's that roar? Do we still do the roar? Yeah. I just love... The mass of this dude. He is so chunky and I absolutely love it. Not even chunky, it's, it's muscle. It's just pure 100% muscle behind that. All right, let's do a few levels into Stam. Not that it matters too much. Uh, actually, I just put all 14 into that, didn't I? Can you sleep? Oh, yep. Flop. Oh. Oh, we just got straight back up. That was weird. Actually, wait, are we technically still asleep? I think we are. Yep, we were still technically asleep. Amazing. <laughs> God. Plays a dino. It's 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 a funky mod, man. It's, that's just what it is. All right. Um, I mean, we can now go and have a look at these gigas without being killed, right? They shouldn't aggro to us. So what did we actually have over here? Blue giga, red giga. There was another giga somewhere. Um, I swear it was over there. Do we go back up there and have a look at what that giga is? Because if it's a female, maybe we can get, you know, put our, turn our charm on. Maybe uh, pull and take them out for a drink or something. They are also stuck. Uh, that's good because I have no stamina. I really can't be bothered to sit down. Hello, lady. Are you a lady? Would you like to come for a drink? You are. Okay. Bro, I've not even bought you dinner and you're mating with me. She is frisky. God damn. Look at it. Oh, wow. <laughs> head on. I don't know what it is, but just head on. The Giggers have the derpiest eyes ever. Look at them both just staring at me. They don't, ha they don't have a clue what's going on in the world. The only thoughts they have is eat meat and breed. There we go. We're bred up. We have a baby. Can I make a nest? <sighs> of course, I need keratin. Amazing. What level were you, by the way? 55? So you must have been like level 30 or something. All right, the Giga Pack, it's a thing. We're going to go and eat this one Deinonychus. Nom, 518. Could we, as two Gigas, kill a regular Giga? Sorry, Hort. I did 600 damage with my stamp. 
That's crazy. I'm just going to eat you guys because we can. That was a 150 Shelly. I'm pretty sure that's max level on this single player thing. All right, let's snooze. Let's get that stamina up. Whilst we're chilling here, let's also give us... Yeah, you know we actually don't have that much health, do we? Uh, let's give us some health. It should heal up while we're sleeping here, right? Can I get that full? Yeah, let's get this full. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to kill another Giga. I mean, there's two of them as well. It's probably just a really dumb idea. Maybe like the Kodontosaurus. Was there one of them down here somewhere? There's definitely two Gigas. There was definitely someone else, but I don't know what it was. We'll head down. We'll see what we can uh, we can find. You know what? We're going to try our luck against this Bronto first. Just because it's a nice big target. And I'm out. I literally walked from that tree down to here and I'm out of stem already. Oh. Oh, what? What? Why are you fighting? You're not hurting it. Wifey, I'm coming. Hold on. I'm coming. What was it? Oh, it was a Verzino. Why would a Verzino attack you? That's so weird. All right, anyways. Wifey, let's go and get this guy. This guy looks at his footer. 518, 542, 563, 585. God damn. Destroyed. All right, it's dead. You need to bite in me there. All right, let's do some of the melee. We do have a captain's hat. Does that look good on us? Uh, it's very small. But it works. It's not the size. It's how you use it. You don't have to leave captain's hat on. Alright, stam is good. Alright, so what are we saying here? Are you a giga? Or are you like... Oh god. Have you been like spawned in for a thumbnail at all? Because you're not moving. Do we fight them? I don't know if I want to fight them. All right, coming through. What what level are you? Let's just check what level you are. Cool. Who knows? I don't want to start biting him and then that other one get involved. Doing it, boys. Uh, wifey. Come on. Okay. We are 100% dying here. Oh, we're raging. She's raging. She's ready to kick some ass. I am getting my ass handed to me. Yeah, I'm going to guess Mr. Red one over here was a, a thumbnail giga. I use single player to do all my thumbnails and stuff. Uh, we are dead. I'm backing up. Trying to back up. Uh, no, I'm dead. I'm pretty sure the wife died. And we didn't even have a speck of blood on that giga. God damn. I see the beam. I see my dead body. Oh, she spawned in. Oh, she's not fighting back. Oh, wait, is she stopped? Oh, they might have stopped. Come here. Come here. Can I whistle you? Come this way. Whistle. Whistle. I'm whistling. Oh, yeah, I suppose the gig can't whistle, can it? <laughs> I was waiting to hear a whistle sound. How did you survive? Why are you running like that? Jesus. You are so hurt. Oh, you're breeding with me? Wow, okay. She is frisky, man. She just sees me again. She's like, bro, I need to breed again. All right, in your inventory, you got you had 200 health left. You were literally a bite away. Uh, all right, I guess have some more health, Mrs. Wife. I guess we're breeding. There we go. Good job. I now have another egg. Uh, all right, we need hiding keratin if we want to make a nest and have a baby giga. Not that it's ever going to hatch because it's going to be a 20-hour hatch thing. Let's see if we can find any carry real quick then before we do wrap it up. But yeah. Um, oh. Why are you... Uh, you're not heavy, are you? Why are you slow? Are you, like, just constantly injured now? Come here. Let me look in your inventory. No? I think you're just bugged out. I think because you've been blooded and battered. Can you keep up with me now? No. Okay, I'll tell you what, wifey. It's been an absolute honor and an absolute pleasure to uh, make babies with you and fight alongside you. But you're going to have to stay here. I'm, I'm going on my own. We're splitting up. It's not you. It's me. I'm, I'm going to just uh, have to focus on myself a little bit. <laughs> okay. Let's see if we can find us some um, chitin then. I just want to, like, drop this egg down and then that can be... You know, for future generations. 
Uh, yeah, nothing up there. I need, uh, I need them packy rhinos again. That Stego's gonna do the trick, not the tech one. So my guy just here. And the tech one's gonna get involved. This is not your business, Mr. Tech One. Why do you even exist? Why is there a robot and knocking about? Uh, we only got five carrots from that. Amazing. Not really what I was looking for. You're also gonna die, I guess. Uh, there's another Stego over there and a couple trikes, actually. Wow, we got element dust. Good shit. All right, Mr. Stego, you are next on the menu. I need all of the carrot in your carrying, please. Every last bit. Oh, 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 I forgot about our stomp attack. Oh, we can hit these trikes as well. Oh, that's sick. It's not as good as that bite, though. Uh, we're actually not hitting any of them. Hang on, wait, wait, everyone, I need to turn around. Or at least come, like, fight my face. They don't, like, bite my butt. Oh. They're all literally just following my butt around. Is it that pretty? We do, like, very little damage with the tail compared to a bite. All right, whatever. We'll use our tail to kill you. There's a Meganera. Nice. All right. There's another trike. You're nearly dead. Are we get any keratin from them? Uh, we got one. Amazing stuff. And there's you dead. God damn. All right. Turn. Turn the radius of a bus. And that might be what we need. Hell yeah, boys. There we go. God, look how quickly we regen health. That's insane. All right. Let's put us a, for the first time, a Evo Paleo Giga Nest. Oh my god. That is a little bit massive. We're going to drop the egg in there. It's going to say maybe like 50 hours to hatch. Oh, no. Just nine. Nine hours and 19 minutes, right? What are we doing? Has this gone down? Stop moving, Mr. Giga. Yeah. Nine hours and 18 minutes for that to hatch. Well, what we'll do. Or, we'll, you know, we'll leave that there. That is going to be the future of the animal kingdom. As long as a, an asteroid doesn't come down and destroy this world, then that's going to grow up and become an even better Giga and then take over the world and all that good stuff. So what we're going to do, we're going to wrap it up. We're going to call it a day there then. So that is the Evo Giga line. God damn, these things are crazy. They are absolutely so cool. I just love the chunky dust man. So uh, yeah, if you did enjoy the episode, make sure you are whacking a like. Make sure you are subscribing. And ring the bell. Never the notifications. Follow the social medias. Let me know what dino line we should do next. Thank you very much for hanging out. I'll catch you in a bit. See you later.